Sonny was first in trouble with the law at 15, then in and out of the jail, where he picked up a heroin habit. I got uh, eight months in prison for uh, assault, and I lost my tenancy, I lost my house, I lost my job because of uh, it. Just, it was a, a vicious circle I was in at the time, so I moved away from the area and that where I stayed. His record meant abandoning thoughts of a career with children in care. Any uh, job I'd apply for, like working with young people, like because of being charged with police assault, uh, they would just think you're a violent person. So I started going into catering work, eh? but even then, some of the charges that I had, like uh, even some employers for the catering industry with the employment. Now he works for a social enterprise, but his boss says getting ex offenders into the habit of work can take up to two years. That's quite a costly process, uh, and that would perhaps scare some employers off. Um, but certainly once you go through that process and, and you manage to rehabilitate them into the ways of working full time, then we certainly end up with um, some of the most loyal, hard-working, committed employees that we have across the whole business. The T provides an opportunity, an opportunity for us in the justice and employability fields to start changing perceptions. Today, Community Safety Minister Paul Wheelhouse told a conference in Edinburgh the government wants to make it easier for ex-offenders to get jobs, part of the plan to cut the time where they have to disclose convictions to employers. When they leave prison, they sit at home, they watch television, they drink, and inevitably they will have children, and that means that the impact of that offence doesn't just impair one life, it impairs families' lives, it impairs the future gener lives of future generations. But if you can repair that damage, you make a real difference. A job gives you so much in life. It gives you work colleagues and friends. It gives you regular, sustainable income. You can put a roof over your head, provide for your family, um, you know, get, get through, buy the things you need. Um, it gives you a routine, it gives you a purpose. Um, you know, so I think a job um, is one of the best social policy inventions that, that have ever ever been. And Sonny says his job has changed his life. I'm getting to see my wee boy, Callan, that now. I've got a good relationship with him. Uh, my wee daughter, Charlotte, and if I was still running about taking drugs and that, I, would, I wouldn't be able to have that relationship with him. Now. And plus, having a job and that keeps me settled, gets me wedgies to go and buy and stuff. And, uh, gave my house up and stuff. Uh, a lot better life, to totally black and white compared to two years ago. Eh? With three quarters of employers admitting they discriminate against candidates with a criminal record, real change may be tricky.